how much do they love Zaslan Akinzan here in Kazakhstan. All right, scheduled for three rounds of five minutes apiece in the featherweight division. Yeah, ah, yeah, he did, okay. I was wondering whether that was going to happen or not. Okay. Yeah, so you're already starting to fight down a little bit. That's hard, man. A point is significant. Absolutely. You've got to get a 10-8 to win by 9-8. Yep. Good movement by Kimazan early, oh. huh? Really good movement. Good front kicks up the middle. Missed a couple kicks by moving his whole body out the way. That's an experienced kickboxer right there. Fans shouting Kimazan's name. He's got that nice style with the chin quite tucked. The right hand really close to the face, guarding against the left. Open hand. Yeah, he's playing defense right now, but great defense, though. Coaches always say that the best defense is don't even let it touch you. It's the best block you can have. Right, it's the ones you don't have to block. <laughs> Man, these guys are trading. And he's got a good front kick up the middle. Oh, boom. I mean, got the Spartan kicking him across the, <laughs> across the ring. The head movement from the Kim Zan. Please. I mean, you can see the way he's just sliding back out outside of range. It's, it shows his experience in kickboxing. Yeah, Bayev's trying to put some combos together, but the head movement in Kimzan so far has been lightning fast. See that? He kind of gets out of the way of that jab. Oh, uppercut. Yeah, now he's trying to land his own offense. This is a smart strategy from Yaman Bev. Switch it up a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Just change up the game plan. We're not liking how that's going. This is MMA. We can we can switch it up. We can do a couple different things. Oh, the right hand almost yeah. caught Akeem's on. It has his attention now. Yaman Bev would do good to go to the body or the legs, too. Totally. He's doing such a good job of moving his head. Can't move the body as quickly. Yeah, it looks like a bigger dude, too. I don't know if you noticed that as well. It looks like yeah. bigger, bigger. It's not just a height differential, especially when he's on the close side of the screen. Look right hand. Oh, a nice sweep. I was just about to see Yaman Bayev's crawling his way back into this, but he's on now. Putting on the heat. All right, Yaman Bayev, how do you get out of this? You know, he's got to swim that, that, that hook out of there. So he's got to use his leg to pummel on the inside of Akimazan's leg and get that hook, get rid of that hook. There, Akimazan just took the hook out on his own. And now you got to press up. Either put your back against the fence or against him. And stand up. He has the hand control. That's what he needs. But, he, but he's, he's sitting and waiting. I'm not sure for what. Great job getting into a 50-50. Back to the center of the cage they go. Yeah, I'm, in, I'm impressed by Kimazan's defense. Yeah, me too. I, lo I love the head movement. I love the sneak and peek and the, the rolls and just, just everything he's doing. 
Yeah, even checking the leg kicks and getting out the way of the body kick. Yeah. Just like that, like he's like a matador. He just gets his arms up and he's back up. Ooh, back yeah, if, I, if I'm Yamabev, I'm, I'm trying to do unorthodox, tricky things to throw off the timing. Timely takedown with 10 seconds to go in the round. Last thing the judges see. And if I'm in this corner, I'm telling them the same thing. You know, let's switch it up. Let's try Southpaw. Let's uh, let, let's try and switch up the game plan a little bit. Let's go with head kicks. You know, throw throw a couple punches and then throw a big head kick because he's doing a good job of leaning back. He might lean into one of those kicks. Uh, try and switch up the game plan just a little bit and throw off the time in there. Here's the man himself, Steve Vermegamedov, watching this main card here in Kazakhstan. He and his matchmaker did such a good job of putting together so many close fights tonight. <clears throat> and I like how some journeymen had opportunities to make a big kill. Mm -hmm. And I like how they're bringing up the kids slowly but surely, but there's no tomato cans. The kids are no, all being yeah. tested. They're yeah. all being tested. Yeah, n nobody's walking over anybody tonight. Yep. They've all been wars. A bit of swagger. Yeah, he's feeling it. He's on trying to let Iman know he better feel it too. I just scored that first round. For for Akeem Zahn, yeah. I, I think he was in control. Uh, and if there was any question on the feet because of the activity of Yamabev, he also controlled him on the ground. So Yeah, he was the matador. Yeah, but Yamabev has been working, you know. He's had moments. We're, we're, we're kind of marveling at the defense of Akeem Zahn, but defense doesn't win you fights. Right. And, and you got to give him credit for, for the activity. This would be a good fight to see the punch numbers, but uh, Yamabev seems like he's working. Yeah, you know, he, he doesn't have that flashy style that makes your eyes draw to him. You know, he's got a workmanlike quality to him, whereas Akeem Zahn has that flash. Right. He's got the swagger, so your eyes are drawn toward him. But just in terms of is it a close fight, make no mistake, it's a close fight. And Akeem Zahn doesn't get to look good yeah. unless his opponent is good. Otherwise, he's just going to look like he's slaughtering someone. Now he's being tested yeah, and he's having to do special things to pull into the lead. Yeah, but where they are right now, this seems like it's the going to be the deciding factor. He, he's able to control him better on, on the ground. If Yamabev can clear up this, then he'll make it a whole lot tighter of a fight. Again with the chance. Double slap. Double ear slap. <laughs> Trying to disorient him there. <laughs> I'm not sure how well that works. I'm not going to lie. Have you implemented slap. it? Yeah, slap yeah. both ears. Did you, you notice know. anything in your opponent when you did it? No, nah, no, nah, I've never. Nah. I've seen other guys do it a lot, though. But I've never really know if it works or not. Good posture from Akeem Zahn. Trying to rain down some ground and pound. Yeah, beating the body up. You can hear those, hear those punches. This isn't looking too good for Yamabev. He's got to move. He's got to do something to give respect back. Speaking of your opponents, you've taken out the likes of Diego Sanchez, Gregor Gillespie, Edson Barboza, hello, Michael Chiesa, 
Francisco Trinaldo, Magomed, Mustafaev, come on, Jake Matthews, Efron Escuero. I mean, yes. studs. And you're just on a tear. Yeah, so I've been fun around to watch. for a minute, man. Man, you've been around, man, and, you, and you've taken advantage of that minute. A veteran at a young age. Oh, this might be getting oh, in the end. It it's like, over! Yeah. Wow! It looks Ruffy like Yama had seen Biff. enough. Might have popped his rib out there. Zasalan, Akeem Zan, working the crowd here in Kazakhstan. I mean, and you can hear those body punches. Those body punches sounded like in the Rocky movie when he was hitting the beef <laughs> in, in a locker, you know? <laughs> yes. Yeah. Solid punches. Man, he knows how to work the body. Yeah, he might have popped the rib out. Wow. Zasalan Akeem Zan moving to 8 and 2. At just 26 year old, years old, we've been talking all night long about prospects. All of these young Turks that Khabib is bringing in, that's what he's doing really well with Eagle FC, right? He's building his own names, yeah. building his own brand, Back building his guys. own fighters. And look at the, the fighters that we've had on the card today. Fighters with 8-1 records, multiple fighters with 8-1 records, 3-0s. 12 and 1, 6 and 0, 8 and 1, 9 and 1, 8 and 2, 7 and 0, 15 and 1, and now Akeem Zahn moving to 8 and 2 and working the crowd up to a frenzy. And that, that, that Khabib's happy with that. The pattern continues. Yeah, Let's make it good. official. Hey. Ladies and gentlemen, the referee's down the ball to Round two, we can fight TKO, Shusalan, I can't